In this video, I have bought the solutions of the homework questions which were given to you after lecture number 3. Question number 1 is Plants make their own food in the presence of Option A. Sunlight Option B. Water Option C. Carbon dioxide Option D. All of these Yes, when you look at all the options, it is clear to us that to make their food by the process photosynthesis, plants require option A, B and C. Hence, all of these is the correct answer. Question number 2. Deer, lion and human beings are called. Option A. Autotrops. Option B. Producers. Option C. Heterotrops. Option D. Food chain. Here we know autotrops or producers are the ones who make their own food. However, looking at the organisms, deer, lion, human beings, we can identify that they all depend on others for their food. Hence, they are commonly known as heterotrophs. Option C is the correct answer. Question number 3. Write the equation of photosynthesis. To write the equation, we have used the chemical formulas. Water, in terms of its formula, is written as capital H, 2 in subscript and capital O. Carbon dioxide is written as capital C capital O and 2 in the subscript. Oxygen is represented as capital O and 2 in the subscript. By using the chemical representation, we can write the equation. For the process of photosynthesis, plants require water that is H2O, carbon dioxide that is represented as CO2 in the presence of sunlight and chlorophyll they make the product glucose and liberate oxygen gas which is represented as O2. Question number 4. Why green plants are called producers? Answer. Green plants are called producers because they can prepare their own food with the help of water, carbon dioxide, sunlight and chlorophyll. This process is known as photosynthesis. In the previous question, we have looked at the equation of the same process. Question number 5. What is the other name of A. 
producers b consumers answer a producers can also be called as autotrophs you all know producers are the ones that make their own food in the word autotrophs auto means self and trophs mean the source from which food or nutrients are acquired so the species that make or produce their own food are called producers or autotrophs b consumers can also be called as heterotrophs consumers which consume their food from other organisms and the word heterotroph can be again split into two words hetero and trophs here hetero means different and trophs means the source from which food is acquired hence the species that consume or depend on other organisms for their food are called consumers or heterotrophs